hockey fans, welcome to the pregame skate. It's gold medal Sunday, finally. 62 games have been played here in Riga so far. Not as important as what's going to happen here today. Canada versus Finland in the gold medal game. Yes, again, it's not 2019, it's 2021. How are these teams in the final again? Well, let's take a look back at what happened on semi-final Saturday to lead us here. Intercepts in from Bjorn and loots it, but scores! So today it's the gold medal matchup. Just like it was when Finland beat Canada back in 2019, three to one, Marco Antilla, captain scoring two goals to help them to victory. Well, today could be a different story. Canada is riding this incredible wave of momentum throughout the tournament after beating Russia in overtime, defeating the United States yesterday in the semifinal matchup. They kind of have a Cinderella story going on here. Finland has everything to lose. They want to go back to back gold medals. Canada could be the people to upset that today. So let's take a look back at Canada's road to the gold medal. He's become Canada's go-to defenseman. Nick Paul with it. Lead pass for Walker jumping in. In comes Walker with a chance. Shoots, pads in, rebound, score! Christian Willanen. Feeds it down to LeBanc. Back at the point. Well, in a hard shot. They score! Tipped by Blackwell. And the United States has tied it up. Jones has been as good as any defender for the U.S. Here's Mangiapane. Works it back in front. Brown with a chance. Peters it down. They score! A mad scramble. Canadian netminder. Loose at the side of the goal. Robinson shoots. Kemper blocks that. And Connor Brown brings it back for Canada. Lead pass to Mangiapane. In comes Mangiapane. And a load scores! Andrew Mangiapane! Semi-final later today. Lead pass for Rooney. Gets in behind Ferraro. Rooney works in and poke check by Kemper. Rebound score! Shibolevsky draws the U.S. back within a goal. Knock rink wide to Garland. Connor Garland got spilled there by Danforth. Paul picks it up. A centering puck. Danforth in shoot scores! And Canada will go to the gold medal game for the fifth time in the last six years. But maybe the most unlikely Canadian gold medal final team we've ever seen. Finland has but two shots so far in the game. Lundell moves in, drops it back. There's what they score! Pakarinen! Let's not act like there aren't great coaches all around the world. So if you... Antela intercepts in from Bjorn and loots it, but scores! Antela to Bjorn and to the back of the net. Cahoon moving in, waits and shoots. Mokadora the same, loose in front. Move back. There it is! Oh, not a shot, score! From the point, Plakta! Otherwise, I just mean has got a slam dunk back door. Oh! He's knocked off the puck, the Finns will set it up, and the defending gold medalists are back to the gold medal game to face the team they beat in 2019. It'll be Finland against Canada for gold at the World Hockey Championship. Okay, the teams do look a little bit different than 2019. Finland has eight returning members from that gold medal team. Canada only has two returning members, but the Canadian team has 21 NHL players to Finland's two. So will that make a difference today? Experience wise, we'll have to see. Both teams are relying on very strong goaltending throughout the tournament, so it could be a tight battle. But keep in mind, Finland has a young talent in Anton Lindell who has been lighting it up. So does Canada. Andrew Mangiapane has been electric on fire throughout the last couple games since he joined the bubble here in Riga. So honestly, it's gonna be either a 0-0 game or 5-5 with overtime. We can't wait to see what happens. So let's take a look at Finland's road to the gold medal. A long shot score! Tipped in front by Oscar's Batya, and Latvia takes a 2-0 lead. Tennyson. 
shoots, scores. And it's the fifth goal for Team USA. Walker shoots, that's blocked by Nobles. And that is empty and shooting for it, they get it. It's a big story for Germany as Canada fired. Welcome back to Riga, Latvia. It is day number six of the 2021 World Hockey Championship. Connor Brown works it back, and a shot by Mangiapane, scores! Andrew Mangiapane, Canada gets its first win. I just tried to lead by example, um, try to drag the guys into the battle and, and go out there and play hard and play my game. Feeds it back to Perfetti, in shoots, scores! Cole Perfetti! Every game starts 0 0, so it's just a matter of uh, scoring more goals than they do. Robin, but that was before Andrew Mangiapane playing for Canada. In comes Mangiapane and a load scores! And Canada makes it a 4 2 lead. We're not done, and we got one more game to take care of business here. Maybe the most unlikely Canadian gold medal final team we've ever seen. We're nowadays, Finland goes to the tournament, we want to win. That's our goal. A chance after Lindell, he scores! Ryan moves in, and he's stopped by Boyarkin. What a start to the tournament for Kazakhstan. Shoot scores! Here he comes to a home with Oyamaki. Oh, score! Finland bounced back after the record, the 2 0 one championship. That Finland knows they're supposed to win. Works in, back to the line, shoot scores! Back and the shot score! Tony Sun's got his second. And the Finns will take over top spot in Group B, run their record at 3 and 1. We know what it requires to, to win this kind of tournament. It's a collision of two 3 and 1 teams that have gotten their very different ways. Walter with the shot scores! And he's tied it up! And shoots! Scores! Time expires, 2-1 on the final score here. For Darzic, Darzic in the back, and shot score! The game is tied! Oh, seconds now, the older time scores! With four seconds left. And Pimlick's tied it up with four minutes to go. Waits works in, and he's stopped by Okanoran, and Finland wins it. So the Finns win the game in the shootout. Canada is a good team, obviously, so felt nice to come out with a victory. In the slot, shot, rebound, score! And a 1-0 lead for Finland. No Kanor with another save. Defending gold medals team for Finland. Soldier off. In, drops it back. There's what they score. Antola intercepts in from Bjorn and loose it. Fred scores. After defending gold medalist, 
are back to the gold medal game to face the team they beat in 2019. It'll be Finland against Canada. Today is your last day to play fantasy hockey, and I mean it. This is it. This is your last chance to top the charts to win our incredible prizes. So we know we had to talk to Eki, who is a Finn, so he probably has a full finish lineup today in his roster. Let's see what he's thinking for today's games. Yo, what's up, guys? Eki here. Welcome to my IIH Fantasy Finals Picks. Me, personally, I'm from Finland. Today's the finals. I have to have five players from Finland. And at the same time, I've fallen a bit behind in the overall points and the playoff points. So I need to go totally off the board. Take players no one is really taking. And hope this pays off and I could make some type of fantasy comeback. So yeah, forwards, Mainalan and Björninen and Nobles. Björninen is my captain today. Hasn't had the best competition, only two points. What he scored yesterday, Mainalan has had a tough season overall but i know he's capable of scoring points nobles leads germany in points personally i think germany will be coming out strong in the bronze game they played very good against finland yesterday easily could have won that game if I'm being honest, I think they might have some hunger for that bronze. Matta and Koivis to my two defensemen. I feel like Matta is the best overall defenseman in Finland. But he doesn't score that many points. I still have him here. And then Mika Koivisto, solid back moving defenseman. And then Jussi Olkinuora, for real the biggest reason Finland is in the finals. Guy has been unreal, have to have him in my net. So yeah, here's my fantasy team for today. But if we are thinking, who are the guys who have the most chance to get points? I would have Magni Payne here. He's been absolutely on fire. From Canada, Connor Garland has had a great competition for the US. I feel like it would be smart to take Germany players as well. For example, Nobles, maybe Sider as a defenseman. And I think Lundell has been the best player for Finland. Would not be too bad to have him out here as well. Quickly, let's go over what happened yesterday. I got 15 fantasy points. Actually, not so bad in the playoffs. There's only two matchups being played, so these fantasy points are hard to get. Olkinora 7 points, Kaski 3 points, Lundell as a captain 6 points. This is the team who had the most points yesterday. The guy I was just talking about, Magni Payne, 11 fantasy points, got 22 if you had him as a captain. He had Donato, Plakta, Volanin, Valker and Kemper in net as the other players. So that was the best fantasy team yesterday. For the final time this tournament, if you want to play the fantasy game, visit fantasy.iihf.com. There's all types of rewards from cash prizes to different IIHF apparel. There's daily rewards as well, so even if you haven't competed to this point, you can still win daily rewards. All right, there it is, the final daily fantasy update. It's been a pleasure. Everyone, enjoy the finals and see you next time. Eki, we made it to the final day of action here at the World Championships, and it's a Finnish and Canadian final, so both of us should be a little bit happy today. How are you feeling? Uh, very good. Excited <laughs> excited for the final. Hope Finland can win back-to-back -back golds. Are you wearing a Finland jersey right now? Yeah, of course. Have to. Oh, <laughs> come on. <laughs> Oh, well, yesterday was really an awesome day of hockey. We were kind of spoiled with some good games. How did your fantasy roster shake out? Um, kind of average, I would say. Lundell got me assist, Kaski got me assist, and uh, Olkinuar got me seven points. He was very, very good yesterday. Other than that, nobody got me points. I got 15 fantasy points in total. But uh, I've noticed in the playoffs, the fantasy points are so much tougher to come by because there, are, there isn't any blowouts and there's only two or three matchups being played daily. Right. That's kind of how I felt, too. I went with an all-Canadian fantasy lineup. Obviously, their top line did pretty well. Um, but, yeah, like, I only got – how many points did I got? I got 29 points yesterday, so I'm in 600th place. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> well – Yeah, not too great. <laughs> I think it was the best decision to go with Can Canada, Canadian players yesterday. Scored four okay. goals, and especially if you had Magni Payne. I think he and had two goals. So, yeah. He's hot right now. You, any any decision, I think he's got to be in your lineup today. Is that what you're thinking too? Or are you going all Finland um, again? <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, actually, for, for me, I'm thinking I'm like in 140th place or something. I'm going way off the board. I'm thinking I have five Finnish players and then I have one German player. But I don't have the I don't have the players you would expect. I don't have Sund. I don't have Lundell. I'm, I'm going a bit off the board. Hoping, hoping uh, for some some kind of miracle, maybe get some get some fantasy points from players. No, but nobody else is picking and move up the rankings, rankings a bit. But uh, for sure, if you want to have the best chance possible to get points, I think Manny Payne has to be up there. Right now, he's been on fire, and uh, the whole entire Canada's first line is is something something different uh, right now. 
What are you thinking for goaltenders? That's a tough one on like a big day like today. Uh, with tight games. It's it's kind of difficult to know who's going to stand up and who's going to, you know, even pull out a win. The the way I've taught the goaltenders the whole tournament is uh, just try to pick a winner and take a goalie from that team. Uh, that's okay. that's the way I've I've done it and it's been pretty good so far. So so yeah, I, I think Olki Nuora. If if you think Finland will win, you have to pick Olki Nuora. He's been so good, so good this tournament. Yeah, yesterday especially, like there were some really close chances for Germany in the final dying seconds, and we were all holding on to our seats. But he stood up tall. So if I would put a goalie in, I would put some faith in him. But Darcy Kemper also had a really good game yesterday against the United States. So it's tough. <sighs> Yeah, and Kemper fantasy wise, he actually got an assist yesterday as well. So he got, I think, I 11. Know, I know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So he got a lot, lot of fantasy points. And then if you look at the bronze medal game, obviously, I think most people's attention is at that big gold medal game. But a lot of points yeah. could be between a Germany and a USA that want to prove themselves. They want to get that medal. And USA had been producing a lot of points on that top line. Yesterday, they were kind of quiet. Do you see maybe mm. them bouncing back today? Hard to see. I. Like you said a little before, I think Germany is very, very strong. Beat Switzerland, and uh, if we're being honest, Finland easily could have lost yesterday. So uh, I think bronze. I think bronze match is mostly about effort. Like who really back to back games? It's the bronze game. Nobody's playing in the final. Who really like who really wants it? I think Germ. I think Germany will come out on top, even though even though USA is a very strong team. Uh, personally, I had Nobles, their leading scorer uh, for Germany in my fantasy team, but we'll see. We will see. And I think you're right about the effort, you know, coming into today. You're a little bit disappointed with how you've finished out here and you will either going to come in and prove people wrong or you're already going to be ready to get on the plane. So we'll kind of yeah. see how the effort shakes out between that match, but obviously attention at that big gold medal rematch tonight between Canada and Finland. I'm going to ask, you're going Finland? <laughs> I can't pick Canada, not, not an option. Let's say like, I would say like maybe 2-1 Finland. It's, it's a low scoring game for sure. Okay, well, I'll have to go 2-1 Canada just because, you know, here's our rivalry right here. And yeah. we unfortunately won't get a chance to catch up afterwards. So we'll just have to put something out on social to see who's happier at the end of the day. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Awesome. Well, we really appreciate all your amazing fantasy advice throughout the whole tournament. It's been awesome to have someone so like in the zone and fantasy to help all the fans out. So today's your last day to, to get in and to get out in action and try to be. So, okay. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Thank you. Thank you for this. Awesome. Uh, it's been, it's been fun. Awesome. Okay. Well, good luck to Jackie. I hope somehow we're both happy at the end of this. <laughs> yes, for sure. <laughs> Okay, hockey fans, before we sign off, we have an awesome giveaway for you today. So this gold medal puck could be yours if you can predict who scores the golden goal. So follow our social media accounts, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. If you think you know who's going to get the golden goal, you could win one of these pucks. So make sure you predict before the games start, and you might be a lucky winner. So today's schedule, we have the bronze medal game, USA versus Germany. That's at 315, followed by the showdown of all showdowns, Canada Finland 815 local it's going to be amazing we cannot wait to see who hoists that trophy at the end of the night we want to thank you so much for tuning into the pregame skate this entire time we've done 16 live shows over 64 games have been played here in Riga we can't thank you enough for all of your support we're going to see you guys tonight because we're going to go live on the final buzzer when the golden goal the golden moment happens so make sure you're following our social media accounts if you want to see what it's like to be there on the ice during the golden game Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm Ailish Forfar, and we'll see you later. Jazzy! Woo! La 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 la! La 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 la! Yo! Sorry, mate. The DJ is going hard. That's a goal. Woo! Oh, you brush your teeth this morning? <laughs> wow. Who wants it? Who wants it? 
Oh, that's a good goal, boy. <laughs> yeah, Cut. Cut. <laughs>